Hello guys. Welcome to Next Logics Tutorials. In this video, you will learn Vue.js events. You will see how to store the data in the database. For that, need a component, an API. Also, we will see data bindings with Vue.js. Let me create a component. You can use the vModel directive to create two-way data bindings on the form input elements. It automatically picks the correct way to update the element based on the input type. Although a bit magical, vModel is essentially syntax sugar for updating data on user input events, plus special care for some edge cases. We can use the VON directive to listen to DOM events and run some JavaScript when they're triggered. The logic for many event handlers will be more complex though, so keeping your JavaScript and the value of the VON attribute isn't feasible. That's why VON can also accept the name of a method you'd like to call. When text box value is changed, VOO component data automatically update. Let me console the data model values. I am passing all the data to post request API to store in the database. I am using Axios library. You can use Ajax function to call the APIs.
If you see my previous videos I have already added resource roots in API.php. Now, I am creating the user mode object to store the data in the user model. In this tutorial, I made a component, data binding and click event to pass the data to API. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and press bell icon to get latest uploads.